Hey, it's Jeremy, AA4JW. I was, wanted to do a quick video and give you a tour of my Parks on the Air setup and how I normally work Parks on the Air. Um, I normally work from my truck and um, occasionally uh, set up portable. However, uh, normally it's in the truck. So I want to give you a quick tour of my truck and show you the equipment that I use and how I've got it set up. All right, we're starting on the outside here. Uh, we'll get to the inside in a moment. But uh, I drive a 2003 Chevy Tahoe. I bought it used a little over, uh, about a year and a half ago now. And uh, decided that it was gonna be my mobile ham shack. So, and that's kind of what I've set it up. It's, everything in it is designed around ham radio and now parks on the air. So there's that. It's a two wheel drive, but I don't go many places that I need four-wheel drive, so that's fine. Um, on the outside, we've got a few antennas. I've got a two-meter 440 antenna on the wind on the window here that uh, came on the truck when I bought it. Uh, I thought it was a cell phone antenna when I first got it, but I connected my antenna analyzer to it, and it's I think uh, 1.3 on the SWR for. Um, for uh, 440, so that's pretty good. Uh, my normal two meter 440 antenna on that side, and then I've got my Tar Heel, little Tar Heel 2 HF um, antenna, screwdriver antenna. Uh, when I'm doing activations, I have the uh, MFJ 1979 17 foot whip on there, and I've got my Parks on the Air flag zip tied to that so I can represent there and then the only other antenna I've got is I've got a WeBoost um, cellular booster since we go to so many parks they don't have uh, always have cell service in the parks that's uh, that helps out sometimes other times not so much all right on the inside I've got my laptop I run a, um, when I'm not at a park or whatever, where I'm not logging, I run a uh, APRS iGate that's connected to a cellular hotspot that's up on my visor. And um, that's, that's nice. This is also where I do all my logging. Uh, because I have an internet connection, I can surf the web if I need to, look up call signs. And whatnot, things like that. Uh, up on the dash, I have my uh, Yaesu FTM 400 uh, XDR. Um, if I'm around my home area, I'll monitor the local club's repeater. Um, but when I'm out and about places that I'm far away from that, I'm usually monitoring the two meter national calling frequency. Um, down in the center, I've made a custom console for my FT891. Um, mounted the head there, the radios, both the FTM400 and the FT891 are mounted in the back of the truck. Um, then I've got a an Ameritron SDC102 um, screwdriver antenna controller uh, with memories. Um, I've got the memory buttons labeled for when I have my normal whip antenna on when I'm driving down the road and then the two unmarked ones on in the corner down there are the outside one is for 40 meters when I have the 1979 on and then the uh, number nine is for 20 meters so and then I've got uh, I've put uh, microphone connectors on this uh, console that I made I use, have my Heil um, adapter, so I can use my Heil headset. I have my trigger push to talk. I've, of course, got my uh, soda. Uh, I bring always bring a cooler with some sodas in it. Uh, I've got my Heil PSE6 headset. I've got an extra headset in the back. That bag is where I put up, keep all my headset stuff, uh, laptop bag, and, and whatnot in the back. So. That's kind of my setup and what it looks like on the inside. 
So like I said, real quick video, uh, just showing my POTA setup. Um, I'm out doing POTA almost every weekend, uh, rain or shine. The exception to that is when it starts getting really warm. I don't want to do it because I don't want to sit in the truck and do that. But then again, I do have my portable setup in the, uh, the back of the truck. And sometime I'll do a video on my portable setup. As a matter of fact, we've got Winter Field Day 2021 coming up soon. Uh, so I'll be doing a video on that. So there you go. Uh, don't forget to like uh, the video if you like the content. Uh, hit that subscribe button for more information. And if you want to be alerted when, when I'm putting up new videos, hit that bell and uh, say all. So YouTuber things. So <laughs> there you go. Again, I'm Jeremy, AA4JW. Uh, you'll see me on the spotting page for Parks on the Air. And you'll see me here on YouTube. Take care. 73.